was your favorite subject in the third grade? <laughs> and I know, hang on, even if you could remember, I'm guessing math was probably not it. Absolutely not. Well, for one, or I should say some Dallas ISD third graders, math is no longer a mystery for them. All new at 6 o'clock, Alexis Wainwright introducing us to the teacher whose rap and rhymes are now adding up to her students' success. 7,000 plus. Math is often complicated and confusing, but for third grade teacher Monique Jackson, the subject posed a problem she wanted to solve. She's very fun and entertaining. Jackson discovered math plus music equals comprehension and fun. And nowadays we have TikTok, so they just really enjoy doing all those fun dances and whatnot. So I said, you know what, if I could somehow incorporate music and math. Jackson wraps her lessons, dropping beats and knowledge with every rhyme. Total parts is the denominator, denominator. When she starts singing, um, we start singing. That's how much we love it. And she's changing the variables of math at Stephen Parks Elementary, and it's striking a chord with her students. It's like I'm super happy, especially when I know I'm starting with her, because she's like the the best teacher I ever met. What number in standard form did y'all come up with? I got onto it and it started getting easier and easier for me. It helps us remember what we're doing. Jackson says she remembers her personal struggles with the subject when she was young. We're also working together as a class to raise our accuracy goal. So she used a common denominator, music, and wrote her first rap over a weekend in November. The students loved it so much, she continued to make more. Now the district is using her bars to break down lessons. Excites me to see that they are not only just learning but they're loving to learn I and mean, you can see that from their faces their body movement problem solved this class makes me like math jackson says she'll drop her next single soon a rap about multiplication in dallas alexis wainwright cbs news texas